If you're in the Enduro world, you've probably heard of the nickname Go Gomez. Now we will delve deeper into the history of the great Enduro rider. Alfredo Gomez Cantero was born on August 6, 1989 in Madrid, Spain. Alfredo is a Spanish trial and Enduro rider whose name resonates throughout the motorsport world. His journey to greatness began early, as he clinched his first regional title in the Alavin category at the tender age of seven in 1996. Since then, Alfredo has amassed a staggering array of titles across various youth categories, showcasing his prodigious talent and unwavering determination. In 2007, Alfredo made his mark on the international stage by clinching the Junior World Trial Championship and the European Junior Trial Championship with Gas Gas, solidifying his status as a rising star in the world of trial riding. His dominance continued in 2011 when he claimed the Junior Trial World Championship title aboard a Montesa bike, further cementing his reputation as one of the brightest talents in the sport. Transitioning seamlessly between disciplines, Alfredo ventured into the world of Enduro with Husaberg. Despite his initial focus on trial riding, Alfredo showcased his versatility and adaptability by competing in prestigious Enduro events. He entered a realm of challenges and competitions alongside top riders like Chris Birch, Graham Jarvis, and Andreas Lettenbickler. In those years, Gomez showcased exceptional skills in Enduro, standing out with his fearlessness and technical prowess on the track. Alfredo got his start in the Enduro world with the Husaberg team, which included top riders like Graham Jarvis and Mario Roman. Training with such skilled riders definitely helped him get better as a rider. Alfredo immersed himself in the camaraderie of his teammates, soaking up their expertise like a sponge. This shared experience will undoubtedly serve as a guiding light, illuminating his path to even greater achievements in the races that lie ahead. In a year fraught with setbacks, Alfredo Gomez emerged victorious at the Extreme XL Lagares in Portugal, marking a significant milestone in his career. Battling through illness and injury, Gomez showcased his resilience and determination, leading the pack from start to finish in one of the Taukest races of the season. For Gomez, this triumph was more than just a win. It was a validation of his unwavering commitment to the sport. With a commanding lead over his competitors, including his teammate Graham Jarvis, Gomez navigated treacherous terrain with finesse and precision, leaving no doubt about his dominance on the track. In 2014, the Enduro world witnessed a significant shift as the Husaberg company closed its doors, prompting Alfredo to make a transition to the newly formed Husqvarna team. For those entrenched in the Enduro scene, this move was met with mixed emotions as Husaberg had long been revered as a powerhouse brand in the sport. Following the acquisition of Husaberg by the KTM Group, Alfredo found himself as a factory rider for the rebranded team. Despite the uncertainties surrounding the brand's future after being acquired by the KTM Group, Husqvarna persevered and remains a prominent force in the world of Enduro to this day. Alfredo continued to compete under the Husqvarna banner, contributing to the team's ongoing success and legacy in the sport. 
Alfredo consistently delivered strong performances, frequently securing podium finishes and often placing within the top three or top five at races. While he may not have consistently stood out as the dominant force in every competition, his consistent presence among the top contenders showcased his skill, determination, and resilience on the track. Alfredo's career took a significant turn when he made the move from Husqvarna to the KTM factory racing team. Strangely enough, this change seemed to ignite a newfound dominance in his performances. Almost immediately, Alfredo began to assert his presence on the track, showcasing a level of skill and determination that set him apart from the competition. The turning point came when Alfredo conquered the toughest race in the world, the legendary Erzberg Rodeo. This monumental victory not only solidified his status as a top contender, but also marked the beginning of a remarkable winning streak. Alongside him stood his sister, Sandra Gomez Cantero, a formidable talent in her own right. While Alfredo was busy dominating the enduro scene, Sandra was making her mark in the world of women's international motorcycle trials riding. With each victory Alfredo achieved, Sandra stood proudly by his side, serving as both a source of inspiration and a reminder of the shared passion that bound them together. As Alfredo's triumphs continued to mount, Sandra's own successes in the trials arena underscored the family's remarkable talent and dedication to motorsport. Alfredo Gomez made headlines with his decision to switch to gas gas machinery for the upcoming 2022 season and beyond. This significant move comes alongside his venture into team ownership, where he'll be fielding two additional riders alongside himself. Alfredo's decision to start his own team stemmed from a long-held aspiration that finally found its moment to flourish. With the landscape of factory teams shifting, Alfredo recognized a gap in the hard enduro world championship for non-factory teams to thrive. Alfredo draws inspiration from his own experiences as a trials rider with Gas Gas, recalling how he was once uplifted by a Spanish project called the School of Champions. That experience left a profound impact on him, and now he aims to pay it forward by nurturing young talent in the realm of hard enduro. Alfredo's team is poised to make waves in the competitive world of enduro racing while shaping the future of the sport. In a surprising turn of events for the 2023 season, Alfredo Gomez inked a deal with Riehu Factory Racing, marking a new chapter in his illustrious career. Under this agreement, Alfredo will not only represent the team on the track, but also serve as a crucial test rider for the company. One of the most intriguing aspects of this partnership is Rieju's ambitious endeavor to develop a groundbreaking new motorcycle. With Alfredo's expertise and input, the team aims to revolutionize the industry with a completely redesigned engine and chassis. Alfredo's role as a test rider is pivotal in this process, as his feedback and insights will play a crucial role in fine-tuning the performance and handling of the upcoming model. This collaboration underscores Alfredo's reputation as a respected figure in the world of enduro racing, as well as his commitment to pushing the boundaries of innovation in the sport. Thank you for joining us on this incredible ride with Alfredo Gomez. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more thrilling adventures. Until next time, keep the passion for adventure burning bright.